self spoken and down to earth. Jonathan Akboburie has not played football professionally since he retired in 2002. Though he spent the whole of his career in Germany, the Nigerian ex international played for the under 17, under 20, under 23, and the Super Eagles. I try to support um, the young players that are coming up from where I grew up. I grew up in Ajegunle, and um, you know, going back to Ajegunle, you see a lot of a lot of talents go to waste. Jonathan, who scored a total of 147 goals in his career as a professional football player, says he's proud of his time in active football. He believes Nigeria needs to pay more attention to preparations for games. We fail to understand that organization has to take place before, before any tournament, before qualifying. We, we kind of ride on just let's play football. Even in our football right now, it's not, it's not really organized the way you want, to, you want it to be. As, as a former professional, um, the things I have learned in Germany is actually organizing everything. Leave no stone unturned, you know, for a game. A part of the Nigerian team that won the first edition of the FIFA Under-16 Championship in 1985, Jonathan scored in the final against the then West Germany. He said the 31 year old promise made by the Buhari administration has only just been fulfilled. We are actually very, very appreciative of it. Um, we thank Buhari personally because um, he came back after 31 years and recognized that you know he made a promise and he fulfilled that. That alone is, is priceless and we would forever be grateful to him for that. In China, for the second time since the 1985 FIFA Under-16 World Championship, Jonathan is visiting Beijing as an envoy of the Star Times Bundesliga. We have the Serie A, and we have um, uh, the Ligue 1 from France, um, where everybody can actually watch, I think, uh, arguably, the one of the best leagues in, in, in Europe, uh, technically and tactically. Um, um, the, it's actually very, very interesting because uh, you, you kind of like see uh, football made in, in Germany. With his experience in the international and home football teams, Jonathan believes the only way football can succeed in Nigeria is if it's separated from government bureaucracy. From Beijing, China, Julieta Aino, NTA News.